Good morning, everybody. Thank you for being with us. Good to see you this morning. 725 now. Time for breakfast. Or maybe something like that. Nick Patrizzi is here from the Jalopy Food Truck. It's a wonderful food truck down at 15th and uh, Guadalupe. 15th and Guadalupe, right? San Antonio. San Antonio. Close enough. Close enough. Yeah. It's right around the corner from our station, and, and they make the most wonderful sandwiches, and they make their own bread. This morning, he's going to show us how to do it. Thank you for being here. Oh, no problem. Thank yeah, you very much. Yeah, yeah. If you go to 15th and Guadalupe, it'll be fine because my truck is a huge, so you'll see me. Yeah, you can't miss yeah. it. <laughs> so what we're going to do today is um, we make all of our own flatbread at the Jalopy, and so yes. um, what we're going to do is kind of show you a quick little recipe on how to make some really fresh naan bread. It's super easy. I used to be fairly petrified of making my own bread because it was more of like a science. Well, and yeah, and it seems like it's a day-long process. Yeah, and it's actually not that hard. Yeah, and it's a little bit more artsy, uh, you know, than you'd think. I and, love um, it. All right, so, so how do we start? What do we start so with? So it's pretty simple. The first thing you need to do is activate some yeast. And so okay. all you do is you get your water. Um, we're doing like three cups of water in there. Okay. Um, and then pour in. Um, some quick activated yeast. Okay. So pretty simple. And all these things you can buy at the store, these right? Are all, the yeast, these are yeah. all simple. It comes in little packages. Okay. So it's very simple. And um, after that sets for about 30 seconds, it'll start activating. Okay. And you can add all your dry ingredients. And for us, we're going to add um, some flour. We usually do six cups of, um, we're using a bread flour. Yeah. It has more gluten in it, so it makes the chewier like bread that you normally get. <laughs> yeah. Versus kind of like the the, the tortilla style. Oh, so this okay. is a little more doughy. Okay. Um, you can throw that in there if you throw want. Throw it in? Yeah, yeah. All right. Good messy, girl. Exactly. Why yeah. not? And uh, what, what we're going to do afterwards is add all the rest of our dry ingredients, which okay. is going to be this one right here. What um, is this? It's just salt, pepper, oregano, cumin, and um, there's, uh, there's a website that have our the yep, recipe on it. Yep, and we just perfect. put part of the recipe up. So, perfect, yeah, perfect, just perfect. go to our website, kxan.com. Pretty simple. We need all that sucker up, and eventually what you get is... Uh, a nice big, you know, ball look of at dough that. like this. <laughs> Pretty simple. Wow, yeah. look at that. That's and fun to play with. I think the kids would love that, right? Yeah, like Play-Doh. Get, get some little minions to work on it for you. <laughs> I've and, got three of those in yeah. home. <laughs> so pretty much what we're going to do is uh, you can take, you let this sit for about 30 minutes to an hour to proof, and okay. it'll get all big and stretchy. And you just sit it on the kitchen counter and just let it, okay. Exactly, and do its, do its thing. It's okay. gonna, it grows about twice the size, so really? it's pretty fun to How see it cool. rise. How cool, the kids would love that. And afterwards, you can just like peel off a little piece, roll that out, and you can do several things with this bread. What we do at the jalopy is we roll it out and put it on our on our grill. Yeah. And so we uh, make a little flat bread out of it. And exactly. And this is what it looks like. Yeah, so you get How this cool. little nice piece of naan bread, Yeah. put it, you know, 30 seconds on each side, and you're pretty much That's good to go. That's easy. Well, talk about your your popular food items here. What have you oh, done so here? these are all like how we make. So we good. take our flatbread. We do our braised chicken and some of them. We have a lot of veggie options as well. Yeah. But uh, this one right here is our San Hong. It's an, like an oyster-based sauce, a yeah. spicy one. We do all of our own pickling as well. So it's got pickled peppers. It's got cabbage, our braised chicken, and a really nice, fun, spicy sauce that we make. Yeah. Um, the other one right here is our, uh, our caprese. So that's yeah. a, it's another similar sandwich. We do um, some fresh mozzarella, tomatoes, parsley scallions, and we make a pesto out of like a parsley and a lemon Excellent. sauce. So it's kind of like a chimichurri. Well, if you'd like to visit the food trailer, we'll pull up their information in just a second. They're located at San Antonio and 15th Street. And to go to and see their other menu items, go to jalopyaustin.com. And their phone number is 814-8557. You guys also cater, too, don't you? Oh, yeah. Give me yeah. a call anytime. And they're, they're going to be out at the Gypsy Picnic Food uh, Festival today out at Auditorium Shores. Mm -hmm. I know. Couple He's minutes. got a busy schedule. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be somewhere? Yeah. Anyway, thank, some more <laughs> thank you so much for being here, Nick. This is really, really good. I can't wait to taste it. 7 29 is your time now. We'll be right back. Stay with us.